For the first time ever, a contestant from Burma took part in the annual Miss International Queen Beauty Pageant on the 1st of November. A total of 16 countries were represented in this battle of glittering tiaras, which is highly popular every year at the Thai beach resort of Pattaya. But more than just a beauty contest, Miss International is a platform to promote the acceptance and civil rights of transgender and transsexual persons. Tanya Maung, 28, represented Burma and said that when she was younger she was shunned by her family. But as Burma opens up to the wider world, she said she now finds people are more accepting of her. At the beginning of my changes, my family had very big problem with me, and also I have to fight every difficulty to get my rights, and also it's a very hard life to 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 face this situation. But now more or less people are more acceptable, and they proud of me who I am. South African contestant Anastasia, 37, said she wants to emphasize that people should be open-minded. Everybody has a misconception that they associate transgender people with a freak show or they're out there to uh, fulfill fantasies. But actually I am a flight attendant. Uh, I fly for, for one of um, a very well-recognized airline and I think that people should not judge. Head judge of the competition, Dr. Seri Wangmonta, said the panel is searching not only for beauty but for intelligence as well. In the end, 18-year-old Marcelo Ohio from Brazil took the top prize and was crowned Miss International Queen 2013. Ai, que todos que acreditaram em mim, é, tá aqui a prova para todos que me apoiaram e eu cheguei até onde eu queria. E é isso. Ohio will receive 300,000 Thai baht, a one-year residency at a hotel resort in Pattaya, and will serve as a goodwill ambassador to promote equal rights for the transgender community.